What's going on guys, it's Shu here bringing you another review slash reaction on Eden Zero. This chapter I will say was actually pretty entertaining. We're finally going to be having some action coming up very soon dealing with I guess you could say the new threat. But overall it was a decently good chapter. I loved what was going on. It's the ship mostly because that was what I'm really hoping to see more about like and now it's i'm curious about klein but we'll get to that in a second but we firstly see the group uh trying to evade fighting but there is really no other choice but to fight these robots and we see this one which i was very uh I guess you could say a very I had a soft spot for and I was not expecting to see how cute it was and it's telling us how like you know they they are they're not every robot is trying to harm but because of Ziggy's influence and what's gone on with the planet some robots have opposed and you know that's something that I was I'm not surprised about at all because it was bound to happen you know we were gonna have droids that really didn't want to attack humans and you know it's it's gonna be like that uh, it was funny though, I will say, before even that happened, where we saw everyone fighting and Couchpo was like, I'll fight too, you know? And she starts munching on the robot, which was really, just really, really random. But what was more interesting, what was going on afterwards, we start seeing them, they're starting to have more attacking. And even going on in the ship, we see that uh, Klein is being v seen by Witch and which act i mean not which uh, sister excuse me and sister's actually seeing her and she's like i hope you don't fix me because that means i'll just have to leave and i'm like i've been saying this these guys are here to stay they cannot leave these guys are new crew members i guarantee you the laguna is gonna end up staying as well they they need a bigger crew and like honestly they just click well together I mean, it, it's really not a surprise to see them be here as long as they have been. And what was a bit strange was the fact that Klein's emotions actually need to be in check. Something must have happened in the past because we actually see how Bro actually was very upset. He was basically saying, please do not. Like, he got aggressive. He actually got all up in Sister's face and was like, do not like reveal what would happen like don't ask her about it because it's gonna be worse so i'm wondering what in the world happened and that's my curiosity as to why she even has to have this emotion controller basically to you know not remember what the past was and i don't understand why he can't just tell her like why can't he actually just tell you know why she why a client can't actually remember this or better not defer to remember so you know i'm just very curious as to seeing as to what's going on there and of course the attack goes on to the ship uh, we see how like hermit realizes that they're being attacked back on the planet and they're also having to do their own thing and we actually see Jin and laguna being the first to like say all right we gotta we got to go out there and fight and i'm i'm looking forward to how these two work together i mean obviously they've worked together when they were with uh freaking i can't remember the previous villain but you guys know drake and joe sorry a brain fart there but we actually see like we won't see this team up until maybe later so i'm looking forward to i'm very curious as to what's going on but going back to the robot the little robot that they were actually talking to we see how like like no oh, no we don't want to fight and all that and it's like all right we'll help you out of course shiki being the way that he is he's like he offers his help but then out of nowhere, we see this bot just get striking down by one of the goons that we had seen previously. And this is why the chapter's named Glue, because we see this dude wanting, he's like, where's your gratitude at? I just saved you. And then it's like, because they're not saying anything and Shiki starts charging at him, he shoots his goo or glue to them and all, all of them are stuck in the tree and he's like oh, let's try this again say your thank say your thanks to me i was like who in the world is this guy you know like what the heck but overall it's very good i think it's going to be interesting to see how these guys interact with the new threat but i'm looking forward to it let me know what you guys think that is it for me i hope you guys have enjoyed if you guys did leave a like and i'll catch you later